Hi guys, so another day in the caravan. As you can see, I have taken down the wall um, that was separating the front and the back. So I can then continue to try and uh, get the roof done. So once I've got the roof done, then I can think about starting to uh, do the floor. Once I've got the floor done, then I will do the walls. Uh, but until then, let's get this roof started, huh? I've got to clear all the stuff out. I might have got a little bit lazy. Um, and it's raining outside. It's supposed to rain all week. Fun times for me, huh? Uh, so that's that's another reason why I want to get this roof done. So uh, yeah. some of that stuff on the floor there and it's uh, yeah all part of the wall so I've taken a lot more of the wall off um, I've done a little bit more of the uh, waterproofing um, oh, sorry uh, I have pulled off the, the the back sort of shelf thing whatever it is and I've discovered there is a little bit of water damage on this side up the top that has it's leaked down from somewhere up here and in where the, uh, the light socket is for the back. Um, so yeah, that's pretty bad. I've, so I've got to get all that out and probably replace some of those little timbers. Uh, as you can see, this side was yeah, it was worse. It was it was worse than the other side. Um, so I pulled all of this timber out, which wasn't hard. It just crumbled in my hand. Uh, I've treated it with some of that uh, that tar stuff, and uh, yeah, hopefully the little holes, the tiny itty bitty holes, that caused all of this rot, uh, will have been plugged. Uh, I do, however, now need to reinforce all of this timber. Uh, I will need to take all of this off as well around the, the windows, uh, reframe those, and yeah, go from there. I uh, don't think I'll need to replace this. Maybe I might need to replace this little bit here because that is, as you can see, it's, it's a little bit wet. Yeah, it's a bit damp. Um, but yeah, um, that's pretty much what I've done. I've done a, probably a little bit more destroying than building. I did, however, put up a couple more, uh, an, another length to get right to the, the bendy bit and another length in the middle here. Um, pretty much the roof. Here is now supported, whereas before it wasn't, it was caving in on those two spots and lots of water was coming in. Uh, once I've got that uh, finished off, so what I'll need to do is just put a couple of support stuff just down the middle, just to give it that extra strength. Uh, I will rebuild the little boxes that go around my air vents. Uh, one in the front, one on the back, and then uh, I will also continue some lengths down here. And uh, what I might do is I might just wall this off flat. I feel as though that's going to be the easiest option. Um, I'm not going to have a shelf in the back here like it was before. Uh, I will, however, have uh, a little flat area and then going flat again. 
just like a, what's it called? Uh, the overhead sort of bulkhead, something like that, just so I can put in a couple of lights and run wiring in, in, a, in, a, in the top of it. Um, so yeah, that's that's my plan at the moment. Uh, it's just getting there, but the roof is getting to a point where if I wanted to, I could start putting some sheets up. Uh, I do need to start pulling that front shelf out, but I'll deal with the back first. Uh, I don't want to sort of overdo it. Uh, and yeah, so um, yeah. Uh, I have been thinking about how I want to lay this out. I've been going over so many just different videos on YouTube, uh, Pinterest, uh, looking at all different designs. Some of the designs are just unbelievable, but I want to sort of build the interior of this smart so I'm not having to want everything in arm's reach, basically. Uh, and before I do the paneling, do rewire. Uh, I will take, be taking all of this old wiring out, um, just because um, I don't reckon it's going to be much good anyway. Uh, if I can get all new wiring, some of the old wiring back in the day, they set some of these caravans on fire, and I, well, don't want that because that would be that would be bad. But uh, yeah, that's, that's about it. As you can hear, it's raining. Um, it's Father's Day, so I think I should probably call it quits for today. And then um, get back into it next weekend. So, we've just had a downpour of rain, and as you can see, it's leaking pretty solidly. So this is a good <laughs> good indicator that uh, I'm going to need to do a little bit more work on here. It's alright, so I'm going to have to chop this um, uh, from probably back to this little stump thing here and uh, yeah, then re reseal it because up here it doesn't seem to be leaking it's just just here but uh, yeah, you can see it's leaking pretty bad uh, that's probably just gonna have to wait till next weekend we're supposed to get a heap of rain this week which is a bit of a shame but uh, look really it, it can't get any worse it's uh, already really bad. <laughs> oh well. What I can do, call these leaks. So on a day that, uh, you know, when it's not raining, I can go out and probably go out and start doing some of these bogging up things. But uh, yeah, I'll, I'll just use my trusty little marker and then draw a little arrow, bright leak, and that way I'll know for next time, and I can fix it. But uh, yeah, just so you give you an update on all that water coming in. Oh well. Um, if you're liking these videos, uh, and you want to see more, just like, subscribe, drop me a, a, a message, I'm happy for you to do that, that's cool. Um, but, uh, yeah, that's, that's the, the caravan starting to finally come along.